start how the lesson that teach, teaches us how to sort two dimensional shapes. So I want you all to open your books to page 541. You need a ruler beside, okay? You need a ruler. Okay. Here, now, for the first one, you will color later as homework, okay? But here, for the first one, we are going to use one block. So, we're going to leave this shape as one block. So, are we... Are we going to uh, to draw any lines in it, or it's already one block? Who can answer, Miral? Is it one block here, one shape? Yeah. So one shape. We're not going to draw any lines here. It's one shape. But here, in the second one, use two blocks. So we want to make this shape this trapezoid as two blocks you can make a line and make two shapes in it two blocks you can make the line here or there or in a different way so i want you now to make a line and uh, make this trapezoid as two blocks you can draw the lines as they're shown in front of you here or in a different way. Yes, Elena? Do you have a I question? have a problem with that. Where am I going to write the line? Inside, inside the shape. So you end up with two blocks. Oh, so in the middle? In the middle. In the middle of the shape? Horizontally or uh, vertically or diagonally. It doesn't matter. I just want two blocks here. Two you blocks? Can... I need to do two lines? Yes. You can okay. do two, rect two triangles. I'll show you how. how. See here? Show us. I will show you. Okay. See here? I will try to draw a line in this way. Do you see? Now I made it as two triangles. Could you see I'll it? I draw it the, the line way better. I made it as two triangles. Okay, do I draw at the red line and the red? The red isn't there in your book. It's just an example for the answer. Iyad, do you have a question? Yeah. yeah, I think so. Uh, but where do I do the line? And which, and which, and which line? And which one? The first one, the second one, the third one? Choose one and do it. You don't do them both because we just need two blocks, okay? Let's go to the other page. Let's go to the other page. This one is very easy. We are going to sort the shapes according to the number of angles or sides or vertices they have, okay? So, for, for number one, circle shapes here. For number one, circle shapes with five sides. Five sides. So, who can do this one? Do it in your book and send the picture to me, okay? Because there is no numbering, so we can't, uh, I can't understand where are you. So here, you will circle this one and this one and this one. Let's count the sides they have. One, two, three, four, five. Five sides, we will circle them. This one. One, two, three, four, Five, five sides, so you will circle them here. One, two, three, four, five. We will circle it, but here four and here three. We're not going to circle them, okay? 
Number two, shapes with more than three angles. Remember, the number of the angles is the same like the number of the size, the same like the number of the vertices. So, we need more than three. So, let's see. This is a triangle. This is a triangle. They have three sides of three vertices or three angles. So, we're not going to circle them. This one and this one. No. Let's see here. One, two, three, four. More than three. Circle it. Here. One, two, three, four. More than three. Circle it. Here, one, two, three, four, five, six. More than three. We're going to circle it. Okay? Let's move to, pay, to, to number three. Shapes with fewer, fewer than four angles. Now, fewer than four angles. So, three or two. And I guess we have two. Okay, here they have six. We're not going to circle it. Here it's a shape with four angles. We're not going to circle it. Here three, less than four. So we're going to circle it. Here three, less than four. We're going to circle it. Here three, less than four. So we're going to circle it. Now, shapes with fewer than five sides. Five sides. So, we're going to circle those three. Here, three sides. Here, three sides. Here, four sides. We finished this lesson. Mm -hmm.